Attention. Be seated. Regarding Officer Dozeman, his condition has been upgraded to guard it. I'm told he can receive visits and he's been moved to a recovery unit. As of this tour, all hand-to-hand -hand undercover buys of CDS are suspended in the Western District. Somewheres back in the dawn of time, this district had itself a civic dilemma of epic proportion. The city council had just passed a law that forbid alcoholic consumption in public places, on the streets and on the corners. But the corner is, and it was, and it always will be, the poor man's lounge. It's where a man wants to be on a hot summer's night. It's cheaper than a bar, you catch a nice breeze, you watch your girls go by. But the law is a law. The Western cops rolling by, what were they gonna do? If they arrested every dude out there for tipping back a high life, there'd be no other time for any other kind of police work. And if they looked the other way, they'd open themselves to all kinds of flaunting, all kinds of disrespect. This is before my time when it happened, but somewhere back in the 50s or 60s, there was a small moment of goddamn genius by some nameless smokehound who comes out to cut rate one day, and on his way to the corner, he slips that just bought pint of elderberry into a paper bag. A great moment of civic compromise. That small, wrinkle-ass paper bag allowed the corner boys to have their drink in peace, and it gave us permission to go and do police work. The kind of police work that's actually worth the effort. That's worth actually taking a bullet for. Dozeman. You got shot last night trying to buy three bottles. Three. There's never been a paper bag for drugs. Until now. 